Hello, nice day today. Welcome to the Occasional Gardener. A little short video on what to do with the sun. Well, here we are outside my little shed, stroke workshop, stroke putting shed stroke do it all everything else um, I recently revamped all this completely there's another video of that going to come up shortly because I haven't quite finished it yet but if you can see this new window that I inserted um, it uh, swings out completely and lets in a lot of light but it's a bit too much light to be quite honest on a nice sunny day let's go and have a look back inside the shed I'm just going to show you something in just a second uh, but apologize for any background noise that you might hear because my neighbors having an extension built and you will hear the, uh, the grinder chopping up blocks shortly and probably interrupt me when I'm speaking but anyway I'm uh, going to show you something just now right here we have the window lots of sun coming in and uh, I've thought to myself how am I going to um, but I, you know, it's nice have, being very sunny uh, but I don't want it in all the time and sometimes when you're doing something you it, it blinds you from what you're actually looking at because uh, that's a bit of a work surface there right there my main work surface is behind me there all the way along there um, but uh, uh, um, where the window is it can be a bit bright so I, I initially I thought I would um, um, get a roller blind um, but they wanted fortunes for them for the size of uh, even just the cheap cut and down ones they wanted about 40 or 50 quid for this size window uh, and I thought to myself what am I going to do what am I going to do uh, well I came up with an easy solution actually um, I looked at uh, car blinds and uh, it uh, solved the problem quite adequately really because I don't I won't need blinds in the winter because the, the sun will be in a slightly different direction but anyway this is what I've got I've got these car blinds and they make all the difference in the world uh, cheap and they cost six quid each and um, uh, you can get them in two different sizes uh, I'm going to install the other two. I've just got the other. I've got that one just to try it out. That one there, but the other two are slightly different widths. So I've ordered those, and they're due in today, actually, sometime. Uh, if not, it might all be ready on the door on the doormat. Let's go and have a look. Well, as luck would have it, they're here. So um, I've brought them down to the shed, and uh, here they are. All the way, all the way from China, and. Uh, amazing isn't it and uh, only cost about five six quid each and we're going to stick one up now I've seen the other one so we'll stick this one up now well taking it out of the packet and you get a roller blind which is this thing here just ordinary plastic film really nothing special suction hooks which I was a bit worried about to start with um, some people got a bit fed up with them and they, they keep falling off. Well, I've had that other one up, which is this that one up there. And that's been up there for about two months. And it hasn't fallen off yet. Um, uh, but the beauty of these is you can take them off when, you, when you're not really using it. Um, you don't have to have it up there all the time. So these two... These two go. These two go up the, the top. This goes down the bottom in the middle, and it and the blind just hooks on. Um, and I'll show you what we're doing now. Let's have a look. Right here we go. I'll stick it out on the window over there, and uh, see what it looks like. Quite simple, really. You know, little kid could do it. First off, we've got the little blind like that. Find your two little uh, didgeridoos that go on. That's one little sucker. And the other little sucker. 
That goes on there like that. Right. So that's ready to go. That's ready to go there. Got those two ready there. Let's just damp these down. Normally I put a bit of spit on it, but not these days. Keep me tongue to myself. Right, that's that. Right up the top here, up, uh, where we go. In the middle, right at the very top. And the little suction hook that goes at the bottom. I think I used a bit too much. I want most of the moisture off. Slide it out. And this one goes on the bottom. Right down here in the middle. And you can see the other one there. That comes down. Ooh. That made you jump. And there. Simple solution. One, two, got to put the other one up here. And it's a simple, it doesn't it doesn't cut the light out totally, but it stops the glare. Um, which is just what I want really and simple cheap solution fixed <laughs>